The exercises shown are for informational purposes only. Only attempt any workout under professional supervision with a qualified trainer and at your own risk. Always consult your physician before attempting any physical exercise. By watching any part of this video, you expressly agree to release and discharge the producers and trainers and waive any right and legal action for personal injury or property damage. Start with that Y, okay, slide the top, okay, let's go and, uh, let's see, we have a good connection here, everybody's good, okay, let's get started again, guys, okay, so start with that Y, slide the top, okay, all right, today we're going to work on our switch hook, okay, so normally when we've been throwing the hook, we throw it a certain way, here we're going to switch off and hook, okay, and that's the premise of what we're going to do today, switch and hook. It allows us to switch our stance backwards, all right? Before we get started on today's switch hook here, a switch stance, we're going to start with our stretch. Start with our Y, so I did cop, okay, all right. Let's go side to side on our neck. Good, uh-huh. And then roll the neck. Go back and forth. Let's rotate our arms. Let's go backwards. Good. Reach over to one side. Switch sides. All right. Cross your arms. Grab the back of your head if you can. Good, switch sides. Try to grab the back of your head. Good, put your hand on your waist. Rotate your waist. Good, switch directions. Keep the uh, twist your waist. <clears throat> then go reach straight down and reach back. Go to one side. Switch sides. Alright, keeping your feet spread apart, bend down sideways. Good stuff, switch sides. And switch on your heel. And switch heels. Go back and lean forward. Switch sides, lean forward. Good, stand back up. Let's rotate our knees. And switch directions. Okay, rotate our ankles. Switch ankles. Rotate your wrist. And breathe in. And breathe out. Breathe in again. And breathe out. Breathe in one more time. And breathe out. Good. Shake it loose. All right, guys. We're going to jump rope. If you don't have a rope, you're just going to pantomime like you have a rope, okay? And just do the same footwork. 
if later you guys want to just get a regular rope here all you need to do is tie it like 10 knots at the end just make it arm length make two of them and you can do the same movement the advantage of having a half rope here you don't have to hit the ceiling you can jump rope on the grass if you're in an apartment you won't make too much uh, disturbance and then also it gives you the rhythm and timing okay all right so let's do that guys get some good energy we're gonna do it just for two minutes okay two minutes and pantomime like you're gonna do the rope work okay good mm -hmm. make sure your feet is moving good uh-huh breathe good uh-huh as you would as you normally a jump rope use your wrist go side to side Double bounce on each leg. Mm -hmm, good, uh-huh. Spread the legs out like you're doing jumping jacks. Switch them back and forth. High knee. If you do have boxing gloves, you can put them on if you want. The boxing gloves, even though we're not hitting anything, it gives you a little bit of weight on your hand. And so if you have some weight on your hand, if you have a 16 ounce glove, 16 ounce is obviously one pound. You put one pound of weight on your hands, okay? So if you have boxing gloves, go ahead and put them on. Have that weight and it has a good feel too. You'll be able to feel the technique and the proper form on this, okay? All right. Today we talk about working on switch hook and switch stance here, okay? So normally here when we're fighting here, our left foot is full. If you're right-handed, our left foot is forward. The right foot is in the rear. The stance is shoulder width, okay? All right? And we use the switch stance here. We switch and we use it most popularly for kick, okay? So we switch and we kick, okay? So let's just do that really easy here, okay? We have our stance here. Switch, uh-huh. As you switch here, see my rear foot? It's already turned out, okay? Since this foot is already turned out here, boom, uh-huh, easy for me to get that kick, okay? Because my foot is already turned out. By switching here, uh-huh, I can get that kick a little bit faster, okay? So let's just do the switch first, okay? So ready, one, good, uh-huh. Two, good. Three, good. Four, good. Five, good. Six, good. Seven, 
Good. Eight. Mm -hmm. Nine. Good. And ten. Good stuff. Okay, all right. So now we know we have that switch and we usually go for kick here. So here I switch, bang, and kick, okay? Switch, kick, okay? All right, so we know that. One of the things we don't want to do is we don't want to jump, okay? So you almost want, like you're sliding on ice. Your feet is actually slipping, okay? Bang, that gives you a fast switch, all right? If you jump, it just tells the person that you're gonna kick. And we don't want that. We don't want to telegraph the kick. We just want to switch fast and get that kick, okay? So let's do that together. Switch and left kick, okay? All right, ready, one. Boom, uh-huh. Two. Boom, uh -huh. Three. Good. Mm -hmm. Four. Good. Mm -hmm. Five. Good. Uh-huh. Six. Good. Seven. Good. Eight. Good. Nine. Good. And ten. Good. Okay. All right. So we know we have that switch stance here. Switching off. Okay. One of the ways we can use the stance here, all right, is to be able to hide the switch. See, right now, when here, when I'm kicking, my right foot kicks, it's one, it's one motion. This is a two-step motion. One, two, all right? One, two, whereas a right kick is only one step, okay? All right? So we wanna hide the step here. We normally wanna switch like it's fast, so it's a half beat, but how are we gonna hide that switch? Hide that switch. So normally if you hit a combination, one, two, hook, okay? Or it's a one, two, switch, and kick. We wanna throw a hook on the switch, all right? So instead of one, two, three, four, we're gonna hide that switch with the left hook as we switch. So it's one, two, I throw the hook and switch at the same time. There you go, good. And then since we threw the hook and switch at the same time, we have that left kick right away, okay? So do it slow, jab, cross. Now we're gonna switch, throw the hook at the same time. There you go, good, left kick, bang, good. All right, so again, one, two, hook, kick, uh-huh, left kick, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Again, one, two, hook, Left kick, good. Again, one, two, hook. Left kick, good. One more time, one, two, hook. Left kick, good, uh-huh. And the reason why this is a good technique in switching, because normally when you throw the hook, jab, cross, hook, they normally expect the right kick, okay? They expect the right kick, one, two, I hook here, my right kick is ready to go, bang, okay? But I can trick them using that switch hook. I switch off, they expect the right kick, boom, good, uh-huh. And because you're throwing the hook on the switch, they're defending, they're looking up high. They don't see your feet move. And that's the advantage of this technique here, okay? Is to hide that switch, make, th make them think that you're gonna kick right, okay? And then kick left. So now we're just gonna spend just two minutes, okay? What I want you to do is one, two, hook, right kick, and then one, two, switch hook, left kick, okay? All right, those two. So again, it's straight, two punches, left hook, right kick, and then it's one, two, switch hook, left kick, okay? All right, so same movement, but it's able to set you up for each kick, okay? All right. Two minutes, guys. Okay, hands up. Good. Uh huh. Find your rhythm. Mm hmm. One, two, hook. Right kick. There you go. Good. Uh huh. And this time with the switch. One, two, switch hook. Left kick. Good. Uh huh. One, two, hook. Right kick. Hey. Mm hmm. One, two, switch hook. Left kick. Good. Uh huh. One, two, hook. Right kick. Mm hmm. One, two, switch hook, left kick. Good, uh-huh. One, two, hook, 
right kick, uh huh. In, one, two, switch hook, left, good. Mm -hmm. One, two, hook, right kick, bang. Uh huh. One, two, switch hook, left kick, good. Uh huh. One, two, right hook, right, oh, sorry, left hook, right kick. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. And now for the switch hook. Bop, bop, switch hook, bang, good. Uh huh. Good. Bop, 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 right kick, eesh, Good. Bop, bop, switch hook, bang, good. Again, bop, 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 eesh, Uh huh. Bop, bop, switch hook, bang. Good, good balance, guys. Bop, 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 eesh, 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 Good. Bop, 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 eesh, uh huh. Ish, ish, ish. Up, oi. Good. Feel good. Feel the movement. Uh huh. Bop, bop, bop. Bop, uh huh. Good. Bop, bop, bop. Ish, good. Uh huh. Ish, ish, ish. Good. Uh huh. Ish, ish. Bop, oi. Good. Bop, bop. Switch. Bang. Good. Uh huh. Ish, 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 ish. All right, very nice. Uh -huh. Get a little bit of water, guys. So now we worked on that switch hook and we're able to kick, okay? So we're able to hide that technique here. So here I hide the switch, I get the left kick, okay? All right? And as you notice, when you do the switch here, one, two, hook, switch, hook, there's not a lot of heat on that hook, not a lot of power. In our previous class, we talked to all the different ways of doing the left hook. This is almost like a check hook. If there's not a lot of power on this hook, but it makes them defend. All right, it makes them defend. So when you do that check hook, uh-huh. So here you can see the switch here. One, two, switch, kick, okay? Here I hide it. Pop, pop, switch hook, whoops. Oi. All right, one, two, one, two, switch hook. I hide the switch, bang on that kick, okay? The second thing right now it does, it puts us in a southpaw stance, okay? So here, one, two, I switch hook. I'm in a southpaw stance right now. My right foot is forward now, okay? So what we have now is we can do overhook, okay? Re front overhook, all right? So let's just examine this for just one minute. I'm the opponent. I'm standing here to fight. You see there's a pocket here for me, okay? That you could strike, all right? You are here. You hit one, two. You switch hook, okay? With the rear hand now, you can overhook through that pocket here. See, there's a triangle here, okay? By switching on that left hook, bang, we have overhook. So let me work with my guy here, okay? All right, he's here, he's trying to defend. All right, I go one, two, I switch hook. There's a pocket here, bang, I get that pocket inside, all right? And the reason why that, that overhook has to come Drill up, you want the elbow high, because the elbow high is gonna direct it right into that little hole here, okay? It's gonna get into that little hole. And that's what we want, we wanna get that, okay? All right, so let's just practice that first slow. Uh-huh, do one, two, switch hook, okay? Now we're gonna twist our hip and twist our feet and get that over hook, right over hook, uh-huh, good. Has to be long, all right, so visualize your opponent, okay? Right now you're standing in front of him. Your left hand is forward. His parallel hand with your right hand is forward, okay? All right, so one, two, switch hook. Bang. Uh-huh, good, uh-huh. Again, one, two, switch hook. Get that overhook, uh-huh. 
you need to drive and drive your feet over, okay, to get that torque, okay? Remember, there's no, not a lot of power on this switch hook. It does have heat, but not a lot of power. Bang, this is where you're gonna get the power. You're gonna overhook, okay? Don't overhook too far. All right, boom, get it, get it down past this chin line and just do that, okay? All right, so let's do it together, guys, okay? All right, using that switch stance. One, two, switch hook, bang. Uh-huh, over, over hook, mm -hmm. very good, guys. Again, one, two, switch hook, bang, good. Uh-huh, again, one, two, switch hook, bang, good. I'll do it a little bit slower. All right, you guys do it at your own speed. Bop, bop, switch hook, bang, uh-huh, good. Again, one, two, switch hook, boom, good. Mm -hmm. Find that little pocket where they're open between this triangle here, all right? You hook straight, right hook straight, you're just going to hit the shoulder. We don't want to hit the shoulder. We want to find that little triangle, a little diamond in there. Okay, one, two, switch up, bang, uh-huh, good. Again, one, two, switch up, overhook, good. Mm-hmm, again, one, two, switch up, bang, good. One more time, one, two, switch up, bang, good. Okay. So now from your from your overhook here, right overhook, I went one, two, I switched hook, I overhook here. Now I have a power, power left kick. Bang, okay? Because the overhook turns my, right overhook here, turns my feet over, turns my hip flat. All right? Gives me the opportunity to really, really wind up for the power kick, okay? All right? So once you do that, let's do it for two minutes, guys. You can do one, two, switch hook, boom. And then also one, two, switch up, bang at the power kick, okay? All right? You can add power kick, all right? Or power knee, left side, okay? All right? Two minutes, guys, okay? Feel it and feel good. And again, we're training while shelter in place. We gotta visualize, visualize the technique. Okay? All right? Good stuff, guys, good, uh-huh. So here, one, two, I switch up, bang, I overhook, okay? Uh-huh, one, two, switch up, bang, I get the kick, bang, good. Uh-huh, and it doesn't have to be a high kick. I switch here, bang, I could low kick too. Whatever's open on them, okay, all right? That one here, probably inside thigh, all right? And then, bop, bop, switch up, over, bang for knee. Power around knee, all right? Any of those three. One, two, switch up, bang, bang, uh-huh. Good. Again, one, two, switch up, bang, bang, good. Mm -hmm. Breathe, uh-huh, uh-huh. Bop, 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 uh-huh, good. Mm-hmm, good. So when you throw that overhook here, bang, figure what you're gonna follow with. You're not gonna follow, easy to retract, okay? All right, don't stay in the pocket with nothing to do. For no intention, okay? All right. Again, one, two, switch up, bang, uh huh, good. Come back, there you go. All right, same thing for left kick. Bop, bop, switch up, boom, bang, good. Mm -hmm. Same thing for knee, bop, bop, switch up, bang, beesh, good, good. All right, again, beesh, 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 good, good. Mm hmm And bop, 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 bop. Hey. You don't have a lot of room, just use the knee instead of the kick. Okay? Ish, 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 ish. Good. Good. Mm hmm Ish, 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 ish. Good. Mm hmm All right. Ish, 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 ish. Good. Anyone? Visualize, bop, 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 boom. Mm -hmm. Very good, very good, okay?
right, good stuff, guys. Okay, so let's just take the first four movements again, okay? We went jab, all right? We went cross, we switched hook, we overhooked, okay, all right? Now we can find flow in this, okay? So here I go one, two, I switch hook, I overhook. Bang, I can follow up from my overhook here, all right? They're expecting the attack to come back from the left side or the left hand, the left cross. But here, since I overhook, step a little bit more, spin back fist, okay? If they're closer, spin back elbow, okay? Let's try with the spin back fist. We won't do too many because we'll get dizzy, okay? All right? So here, do it slow. Jab, cross, switch hook. Right foot is forward now. Overhook, follow through. Bang, spin back fist, okay? All right? So again, jab, cross, switch hook, bang, bang. There you go. See that flow that goes with it? Mm -hmm. You set them up that way, okay? One, two, switch hook, overhook, bang, good. And now if you did it with intention, like you know you want to try to set them up, once you go with that overhook, boom, boom, you kind of flow into it, okay? Or if you don't have that intention, switch hook, bang. See what's open? Bang, okay? Because you overhook here, I'm the opponent, I'm standing here, okay? You have overhooked me, all right? You have the option to pull my hand down too with that overhook. So here you got that triangle, you can pull the hand down, bang, and strike, okay? All right, so if it's not the intention here, all right? So if you can visualize it once again, I'm the opponent, you hit one, two, you overhook here. All right, that's your punch here. Boom, pull my hand down, bang, swing, swing, spin, spin back fist on the face, okay? All right, so we'll try that, okay? Again, one, two, switch hook, bang, boom, good, uh-huh. So you have three ways here. One, two, switch hook, overhook, step and go. The other way, one, two, switch hook, overhook. Push the hand down, bang, uh-huh. Or flow into it. One, two, switch hook, bang, bang, okay, all right. Clear the hand and go, okay, all right. There you go, beautiful, beautiful, okay, all right. Don't overstep, guys, okay, all right. So let's just try that. We'll just do that for one minute only, okay? And then we'll work on the other side, okay? All right. So go ahead, use that guys, use that technique, uh-huh. One, two, switch hook, overhook, bang, good. <clears throat> mm -hmm. One, two, switch hook, overhook, bang, good. Uh-huh, good. One, two, switch hook, overhook, boom, good. Uh-huh, and again, if you see them closer, you can use the spin back elbow too, bang, overhook, bang, bang, uh-huh. Good, uh -huh. there you go, good. Uh -huh. You create angles, you create movements, okay? All right, very hard for them to figure out what you're gonna do. You're hitting them from all directions, all heights, all angles, all distances, all right? Makes it very hard for you to be predicted as a fighter. Good, but you gotta know your balance, gotta know your technique, and know your feel, okay? Bop, bop, switch hook, bang, bang, good. Mm -hmm. A few more, okay? All right, ish, 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 bang, uh-huh, go, sorry. Switch hook, there you go, good, okay? All right, so on the same token here, all right, we're gonna do the same thing now. One, two, switch hook, over hook, and this gives us a big wind up, bang, okay? for right spin back fist, okay? All right, this one you're gonna generate a lot more power. One, two, switch hook, bang, okay? They're expecting a kick to come through. Especially you set it up for low kick. They think the kick is coming low. After you overhook here, bang, all right? Spin back fist, okay? All right, and that's gonna be on their open side of their face. That's gonna hit them on this side of the face. Spin back fist, bang, okay? All right, so let's try that slow. Uh-huh, one, two, switch hook, overhook, step, bang, uh-huh, good. 
Mm -hmm. Again, one, two, switch hook, over hook, step through, bang, uh huh, and step through just enough to be outside their center line here, okay? All right, again, one, two, switch left hook, over hook, step, spin, good, uh huh. As you step, you can push the hand down or whatever, okay? You can do that. We'll do either one, okay? All right? So now we're gonna do it, another one minute drill, but you're gonna set this up, okay? So I go one, two, I switch hook, I over hook, I low kick, uh-huh. I do the same technique again, switch hook, over hook, I don't low kick this time, bang! I hit the spin back fist, okay? All right? So you set up the pattern, break the pattern, okay? All right? One minute, just with that technique, okay? Set it up with left low kick, okay? I go one, two, I switch hook, I over hook, bang, I low kick, mm-hmm. And then again, one, two, switch hook, I over hook, bang, good, spin back fits. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, good, uh-huh. You ever spar one of our fighters, Johnny Jackson, he'll do this to you. He'll switch over on you, he'll hit you like you're surrounded, okay? All right, that's because he's cutting angles. He's changing rhythm. Low kick, good, uh-huh. One, two, switch hook, over hook. Bang, good, uh-huh. Spin back fist. There you go, good, uh-huh. Changes the elevation, and this is definitely, when you do the spin back fist, you're generating a lot of power, because this hand is going 360 degrees, okay? All right, and the same thing, bop, bop, switch hook, over hook, you're too close, boom, use the elbow instead, okay? Either one, good, uh-huh. Very nice, guys, good. One, two, switch hook, over hook, good. Bang, set up with low kick. Mm -hmm. And one more. One, two, switch hook, over hook, bang, good. All right, get some water, we'll work on the next thing here. Now we learned various ways of hiding that switch step, okay? Switch step, hiding that switch step with the hook, okay? All right. And let's just look at the efficiency on this, okay? So let's say I do one, two, hook, cross, I switch, I left kick, okay? So let's count the movements. One, two, three, four, five, six, all right? All right, but here, one, two, three, four, five. I steal a step, I steal one step out of that because I do the switch on the, on the hook. One, two, three, four, five. Mm -hmm. So conventionally, you guys have been doing this. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we steal a step away from that, changes the rhythm of the timing. Boom, bang, okay, all right, okay. Using the switch step again, okay? We used it for kick, all right? We used it to set up for the hook. We use it for overhook on the right side, okay? Now we use it for knee pass, all right? The knee pass here, when you see a fighter stance, is always a, what we call bladed stance. Right now, my left foot is forward, my right foot is in the rear. My shoulder is bladed, okay? My shoulder is like 11 o'clock to five o'clock, okay? My shoulder is bladed. So my side is open here, okay? So here, all right, if I'm fighting that bladed fighter, okay, I'm here, I'm, I'm the opponent, my bladed side is here, I'm open here, okay? I'm fighting him, one, two, I use that switch step. For me to get that knee in, that knee goes right into his bladed side here, okay? So let's just try to imagine here, with my little dummy here, okay, all right? We know that he's standing, he's left hand, his blade is going this way, okay? His blade is here. So I one, two, I blade, I get that switch, I get, I get the knee on his bladed side, okay? If I do a right knee, 
He's bladed this way. One, two, I right knee. See, I have a chance of going in parallel with that, with the bladed body. I just have a small straight target, okay? So it doesn't give me a perpendicular strike. In any knee strike you have, the perpendicular target is most strong. That's why when you see people knee, they're pulling down. If I knee this person here, my knee is going up, his body's up. If I can pull his body down, see this is a perpendicular strike, all right? It's like a T-bone car crash. And that's the strongest knee you're gonna get because the body's flat against the knee. And that's what we're looking for, okay? So now we're gonna use that switch stance, okay? All right, that switch for the knee pass. Boom, okay? We're gonna switch in knee, okay? And you're gonna glide through, okay? What we don't wanna do here, we don't wanna hop, tell people what we're doing, okay? We wanna glide through, one, two, switch, boom, uh-huh. Walk in with that knee, try to control the top of the head, okay? All right, so we'll do it together. Hands up, I hit one, two. I switch stance, my foot is turned out, Boom, I go with that left knee. Okay, all right. One, two, switch. Boom, uh-huh. Left knee, there you go, uh-huh. One, two, switch. Boom, good, uh-huh. And one more time. One, two, switch. Boom, good. So now we see he can see the switch. One, two, he can see the switch. Boom. So now we're gonna throw that switch hook to hide that switch. One, two, I hit the switch, boom. My hand is already out on the hook. I try to grab that head, touch the top of the head, and pull down. So I'm hiding that switch that for that left knee, okay? All right? So hide that switch, okay? So one, two, bang, bang, uh-huh, good. Again, not a lot of heat on that, okay, hook, but it's enough to make him shell. When he's shelling here, He's open in the body, open in the lower body, okay? All right, so again, one, two, switch hook, bang, walk that knee in, good. Again, one, two, switch hook, boom, good. Again, one, two, switch hook, boom, good. Mm -hmm. One more, one, two, switch hook, boom, good, uh-huh. All right, the last way on this one here, we can use the rear hand to pass, okay? So I go one, two, I switch hook, I push, and knee, okay? All right, and that's for that left hand, okay? Once you go up here, okay, once you make your fighter shell, all right, so here, I'm, I'm, I'm you, I hit one, two, I switch hook, I try to knee, okay? All right, if I'm the opponent, you hit that combination here, I shell, I see you getting in, I'm gonna try to clinch, okay? When I clinch, this left hand is forward. And that's why when I throw the hook, I wanna parry that hand and come in, boom, with that knee. Slight parry with the right hand, okay? So I'll do it slow. One, two, switch hook, boom, boom, good. Mm -hmm. Again, one, two, switch hook, slight parry and knee. Good, uh-huh, good, again, one, two, switch hook, parry and knee, good, uh-huh, parry out and knee, okay? You guys have learned this at Muay Thai America as this technique, one, two, boom. You learn to switch and parry at the same time. This time we're not gonna do that, we're gonna hide it with the hook, all right? Defend against that left hand and strike with that knee, okay? All right, so one, two, switch hook, Boom, good. There you go, very nice guys, very nice. Very nice, Gary, very nice guys. All right, the same thing, one, two, switch hook, parry the hand, boom, good. Mm -hmm. So visualize, okay? You throw the one, two. You throw the left hook, switch hook. He's shelled, okay? You see him shelled. He's gonna reach out with that left hand, you parry that hand, and drive that knee in. Okay, all right. So one, two, switch hook, Carry your hand, boom, and knee. Good, uh-huh, one more. One, two, switch hook, carry your hand, and knee. All right, so we're gonna do that. Guys, we're gonna try two minutes on this drill, okay, using the three. And we'll review what they are, okay? So you can hit one, two, switch hook, uh-huh, knee, mm-hmm. 
one two switch hook parry and knee okay and one two to switch a knee okay without the hook okay all right use any of those okay guys see visualize your target mm -hmm. make sure you're driving that weight forward on that knee okay bop 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 uh-huh good mm -hmm. don't let them get that clinch on you okay bop bop boom uh-huh bop uh-huh good you can even do it the over process we did before bang bang we already did that already now we're trying to get the fast pass here boom boom switch hook for that knee good make them cover ish, ish, ish. Very boom, B. Good. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Four. One, two. Switch in knee. Uh huh. Good. Mm -hmm. Again, not a lot of heat. You try to turn the shoulder on that switch hook. Turn that shoulder and drive that power because we don't have a full power on that hook. Here you go. Good. Uh huh. Again. Bop, bop. Boosh. Boom. Good. Mm hmm. Bop, 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 Ooh, bop, bop, uh huh, good. Mm hmm. Two more, uh huh. Ish, 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 there you go, good. Uh huh, ish, 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 ish. Mm hmm. Alright, bop, 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 boom. Mm hmm, visualize, okay. Good. Feel that, uh huh. And you know when you have your gloves on, you can feel where the movement is, okay? Where the hands are, okay? Where the palms are, okay? One, two, switch hook. Boom, uh-huh. Good. Again. One, two, switch hook. Bang, good. Mm-hmm. Again. One, two, switch hook. Bang, bang. We did that earlier. Mm-hmm. Any technique you want from there. All right, very good. Get a little bit of water and go through one more technique, okay? been to Muay Thai America and you got to spar one of our fighters, Victor Saravia, okay? He used to switch stance a lot to get in and also to get outward, okay? He uses it to create a small angle. So here, let's look at our grid, all right? So assuming that I'm standing in front of my opponent here, okay? My opponent is still on the grid also, okay? All right? So here I hit one, two, I switch hook, okay? I'm already outside the box with that hook, okay? And see, he's gonna start creating angles on you, moving counterclockwise, all right? And that's why it's really hard when he uses his technique on you, all right? You think he's hitting you and he's moving upward, okay? And moving around counterclockwise on you, all right? You as the opponent, he's moving around you here, okay? He's moving away from your power side. Even if you try to kick him, you have to over kick. Okay, you lose the power even if you hit him because he's he's past the center line. Okay, so now I'm going to use that same thing for the switch hook. One, two, we switch hook. We make sure we switch hook. We're not in the box. All right, we switch hook. We're outside the box. We drive an uppercut. You see, I swing my foot out with the uppercut. Now look at the line I've already created. I created a diagonal line against my opponent. Okay. So we'll do it again slow so you guys can follow together, okay? So I hit one, two, okay? I switch hook, but my foot is outside the line here, okay? I uppercut, swing my foot back, okay? My right, my left foot back, okay? So we create a small angle on that. One, two, switch hook, uppercut, mm-hmm, good, uh-huh, good. Again, one, two, switch hook outside the box. Good, swing the rear foot as you uppercut, uh-huh. All right, it's a long uppercut, guys, not a short one, okay? 
One, two, switch hook, bang, good. Swing that foot back on the uppercut. This is how we're creating angles against our opponent. One, two, switch hook, uppercut, good, uh-huh. All right, so what does he usually do to you here? Usually he takes another step and he low kicks. Or he throws a left cross to the body, okay? And he resets or he continues, okay? All right, so for now, let's just do the left cross to the body, okay? One, two, I switch out, uppercut, bang, all right? I go left cross to the body, okay? So here, one, two, I switch hook. You see how I come forward a half a step on that switch hook, all right? I uppercut, I swing. Now I'm gonna throw that left cross, okay? My foot now moves to the top of the corner of the box, bang, right? Left cross to the body, okay? All right? So again, one, two, switch hook, bang, bang, good. Now look at the angle I created. I stole a full step on my point, and I've also stolen about uh, 20 degrees, more than 20, about 20 degrees on them, okay? All right? So one, two, switch hook, uppercut, bang, uh-huh. Good, uh-huh. And don't be afraid to throw from the south pop side, okay? All right, one, two, switch hook, uppercut, bang, good. Uh-huh. And you see the footwork here. Bang, one, two, switch. Mm-hmm. Uppercut. See how the footwork is stealing in. We're stealing in, okay? One, two, switch hook, uppercut, bang, uh-huh, cross to the body. Very good, uh-huh. Again, one, two, switch hook, uppercut, bang, cross to the body. Okay, all right. Now we do the same thing. Usually he's gonna use the left kick on you. One, two, he switch hooks, he uppercuts, bang, he left kicks to the body or to the leg, okay? All right. You spar Victor, you're gonna see this happen, okay? All right. So one, two, switch hook, uppercut, bang, uh-huh. Low kick instead, okay? Again, one, two, switch hook, uppercut, bang, good. Mm hmm Again, one, two, switch up, uppercut, bang, good, uh-huh, all right, one more, one, two, switch up, uppercut, bang, or bang, okay, so spend another two minutes, guys, using the technique, okay, if you want to substitute uppercut, body hook for uppercut, or overhook, you can still do that, all right, but for now, the basics here, because I created that angle, I can come underneath your guard here, all right? That uppercut can come underneath your guard here, all right? And then cross the body or left kick, okay? Two minutes, guys. Make sure you're moving around, but make sure you're moving around naturally, all right? Don't try to intentionally steal that step. You steal steps by baby steps. Bop, bop, baby step, baby step, bang, good. Uh, baby angles, okay? All right, one, two, switch. Bop, boom, good. Mm -hmm. One, two, switch. Bop, boom, low kick, good. All right. Again, see that grit here? Ah, ah, bop, bop, boom, good. Mm -hmm. You can body kick as well. Oosh, oosh, switch. Bop, boom to the body or even bang to the head, up to you. Okay, all right. Usually the low kick is very, very effective weapon. Boom, 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 all right? And the reason why is because one, two, three, four punches have come to the head. Bang, change the elevation for the low kick. All right, again, bop, bop, switch, boom, bang, good. Use your momentum, very nice, Kenzo, very nice. Good. Nice, Kateri, good, uh-huh. Not so wide, Kateri, on the switch hook. Just a little bit. So my head is in the center line here. When I switch hook, I'm out of the center line just a little bit. Again, we steal the angles with baby angles, okay? All right? Too much is too slow. Too much is too slow, all right? So here, again, bop, bop, switch, bang, boom, good. Mm-hmm. Again, one, two, bop, bop, ish, good. Mm -hmm. Good, when you throw that body cross, make sure you're bent down so arm is parallel. Don't body cross like that, okay? With the arm not parallel 
horizontal. Okay, bop, 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 bop. Boom, good. All right. Again. Ish, 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 ish. Good. Good. Stealing angles, guys. Stealing angles. You're on a higher elevation if you don't just go straight in and straight out. All right. Let's review everything that we learned, okay? So hope when you take these classes, again, if you want like a cardio workout, there's plenty of tie bows, there's plenty of punches and squats, you know. I have another client that I'm doing classes with that I'm filming, they're bag classes. If you have a bag, you can do those too, and I'll send you the link for those, okay. But here, since we're training alone, training in shelter in place, okay, let's take the opportunity to try to learn techniques, learn alternative techniques, okay. Again, many of you guys have sparked Johnny Jackson, one of my fighters, or Victor Saravia, okay? And you can't figure out why you're hitting him here and they've already ran circles around you, okay? You don't know why, okay? But if you have this fight IQ, you can start seeing how he's stealing that step, how he's moving around, okay? You can see how he's creating those angles. Even if you can't defend it against it right away because you're not the same level, because these guys, you know, highly skilled amateur, highly skilled professional fighters, but you at least have the comprehension, you know what's going on. The worst is to not know what's going on. The worst is that you're fighting and you have no idea why somebody is hitting you, kicking you, and they already ran a circle, half circle around you, a quarter circle around you, okay? So Fight IQ for me, and I'm very proud of all the fighters at Muay Thai America, I'm proud of all the students at Muay Thai America, because they have a very, very high Fight IQ, all right? Fight IQ is really, once you know Fight IQ, you can vary any technique that you want because you know the principles behind it, okay? All right, so today we worked on switch, okay? Switching that left foot in, okay? And we know we don't want to do this. We don't want to jump up. We always want to glide like our feet is just slipped, okay? Because we don't want to make it a full step. We want to make it like a half beat, okay? And if we glide and we can push forward, it gives us that momentum, okay? So we worked on that switch hook, bang, okay? Switch hook, bang, good. And we know it's not as powerful as your full hook, even though it's coming from the rear, but the hand really doesn't, the shoulder really doesn't drive back, all right? So you've got to twist into it to create some heat to make your opponent shell, all right? So here, when we did one, two, switch hook, okay, good, we switch hook. We knew we can set up the left side, okay, all right? When we switch hook here, we know we can, we put it ourselves in the south paw position. We know we can overhook. Get that little triangle inside for overhook, all right? Don't try to punch straight, don't try to hook to the shoulders, okay? Again, when you guys are working with the mitts here, your mitt holder is holding the mitts here for, for hooks, it's, they're holding it too low. Unless it's intentionally hit the solar plexus, okay? But the mitts have to be high, because the face is, is, the intended target is the face, okay? Not the boobs, not the shoulders, okay? All right, so we know we switch, Bang, we got that overhooked, okay? We know we can follow up from the overhook. Bang, we can follow up with spin back fists, okay? We know we can follow up with low kick. And we know when we switch up, we can follow up, fake the low kick, spin back fist on the right side, okay? So you start knowing different ways of how to do this, okay? We also know when we switch here, we can slide that knee in, that left knee in. Bop, bop, switch hook, knee, okay? All right, the one you know already is just slip and go. All right, you just know that one, okay? But you also know, switch hook, and then just as a precaution, when they're trying to clinch or punch with the left hand, you go and slide that, okay, slide that knee, okay? All right, and then you know how we can steal angles, okay? Boom, so we switch. We step up just a little bit on that hook, all right? But we use the second technique, third technique to start to create angles, okay? 
Lomachenko, man, he is like stealing angles from you like tomorrow. One of the greatest boxers, okay? And he's using that to steal angles from you. One, two, switch, bang, bang, or bang, okay? Creating small angles at all times, okay? All right, great work, guys, okay? All right, thanks for joining us today. I know it's a little bit hard or whatever, but try to practice. If you even get half of these, all right, half of the techniques down or whatever, it just makes you so much a better fighter, and then later the rest will start coming to you, okay? All right, I'll see you guys on Friday, 10 a.m. Spotty Cup, good job, guys, okay? See you later.